So it's the 20th episode, and I don't think you guys have a single clue who I am, so that's what I'm here to do today. My name is Guyane. I am a broker associate here in Denver, Colorado, and broker associate basically is just a fancy word for real estate agent, but here in Colorado, that's our title and it sounds fancier than real estate agent, so I'm gonna go with it. I originally was born in Armenia and then I moved to Los Angeles when I was five years old. From Los Angeles, I then went to UC Santa Cruz, shout out to the banana slugs if anybody watches. And from Santa Cruz, I decided to move to Denver, Colorado. When I moved here in 2018, my initial goal was to be an attorney and Waitlisted. When I was waitlisted from law school, I really just took a step back to examine what I wanted to do. I felt like I was in the right place. I got my bachelor's degree in legal studies. I worked at a law firm and I was in corporate America, but I hated it. I didn't really understand that there was anything outside of that. In college, really, they teach you to go to college, get a job with your degree, and then what? Like stay there for the rest of your life and potentially hope for some kind of pension or social security so you could retire. <laughs> My background in real estate really started after I read a book called Rich Dad Poor Dad, which I think everybody and their mother <laughs> has read. Um, but I didn't know that there was a life outside of corporate America that was a successful one. I come from another country. My mother doesn't know much about this and my stepdad was the one that introduced everything to me. After reading Rich Dad Poor Dad, I decided to take a Robert Kiyosaki type course. It was actually a course sponsored by him and that taught everything that he was talking about. Just real estate investment basically. Now, this course to me was an investment um, as opposed to going to law school, which was also an investment. So I joined the course October of 2019 and I met with a mentor and I ran through wholesale, lease option to buy and foreclosures. I have a big background in real estate, quote unquote, because I'm very educated about it. Um, however, I wouldn't say that my experience um, is equivalent to my education. Obviously you can sit and learn as much as you can in a book and read as many vocab terms or whatever else that you think you're gonna read that's gonna make you successful in that specific topic. But until you're out there experiencing it, it's a whole different playing field. Once I got to the end of the course, I finished early and I decided I was gonna take it on and start doing wholesale by myself until I can build enough money to go and do a flip. Now, mind you, this is in the middle of a panoramic. March of 2020, I decided I'm gonna quit my job. I hate corporate America. The world is ending. I might die. Everybody around me might die. Why not go be happy? So, like everyone else that comes to that realization, they decide to go to real estate. Being a real estate agent is like, maybe I wanna say equivalent to a billion times better than working at a law firm. Up until June, I was really going through it. It was very difficult. I hadn't done a deal. I wasn't making any, any progress. I was definitely talking to people, but the numbers that I was running everything off of uh, because of what the school had taught me were based on a national level and the Denver market is completely different than the national level. That is something I would definitely say if you're looking to get into some kind of course um, to broaden your knowledge on investment, make sure it's based in your local market. That's kind of one of the biggest regrets that I have. At the end of June of 2020, I was speaking to Maddie, who I've talked about in my videos before. Maddie works for your castle and is amazing. Love you, Maddie. Maddie was like, hey, get your license and come work for us. And I was like, Okay. Like I have said in a previous video, I kind of decided and made the big move within like two months. So I was licensed uh, technically in the beginning of September. There is such a tough market right now in Denver and I am totally open to telling you guys that I've been in real estate September, October, November, December, January, February, March, six months, seven months and I have done zero deals. And that's just the reality of it. I can sit here and put up a green screen and talk to you because I'm educated so you think I know what I'm telling you, but this is just an illusion. An illusion. Everything around us, this, all fake. This, 
real. The content that I post, I go out of my way to make sure that it is good content because all my buyers see it, all my sellers see it, all my investors see it. I'm in the business of making relationships and I don't really care about making a quick profit. And that is that folks. I hope you enjoyed this long tangent about me. I hope um, you probably didn't learn anything. Maybe you learned something about me. Maybe you want to get into real estate. Maybe you don't because you have to go maybe six, seven months without a paycheck and be okay with it. If you have any questions for me, please leave them in the comment bar below. I would love to talk to you guys and I'll be here next Wednesday with more entertaining, less me content about God knows what. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check me out on Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn at Broker Guyan. This is a long outro. I'll see you guys later. If you see me on Clubhouse, mind your business.